Hey guys, I'm Shark from Team Burst again, and today we have New Yorker Weekly Countdown on Week 3. Sadly, this week is not exciting as the other two weeks, and we only get common and rare. But uh, I guess we just can't get good thing all the time. Unlike the first few weeks, that this review is not the best. But let's go all over four card them. Well, we're gonna go over three. I'm gonna talk about the first one right here right now because it's very easy. It's just 12k base. Uh, you already know the benefit. It's basically the same as all the other 12k base from all the class. So yeah. So let's get started with a three card. See you guys in the next scene. So our first grade two is a grade two with 10k base. Her skill, uh, her name is Moral Education Maiden Maya. Her skill is act uh, act on rear guard once per turn. Cost soul blast once and retire any number of your plant token. During this turn, this unit get the total power of the unit retire. So let's talk about the positive. It clear token when needed. Okay. It make a fee. It make a buff on itself. Okay, I guess. Now that's basically it for the positive. Let's go with the negative. It doesn't really work well with the new token. You might think it will since, oh, you get plus 10k. But to be honest, in my opinion, you would rather have the new token as a 10k interceptor on the few more than uh, this unit that can bomb itself a bit. I would rather run Kaiven over this, to be honest. Like, I guess if you can uh, make a lot of resource, you can use this card. Retire 4 10k plant, become a 50k beater. Oh, <laughs> nah, that's too much cost. I don't think this card is worth it. Not even in budget, to be honest. Maybe, like, as a people might just have it at very budget level. But yeah, hope you guys enjoy. For our next grade, dude, that is actually pretty good. Not like the other one. <laughs> It's Primal Wine Dragon with a grade two. It's a grade two with nine key power and five key shield. Her skill or his skill or whatever it gender is. Skill is continuous on Vanguard and Rearguard. During the battle where this unit is boosted by a grade zero, attack a Vanguard. The opponent must call two or more units at the same time when calling from hand onto Guardian Circle. This card is pretty good. Um, let's talk about the positive. The positive is it's a pre plus special. It's a free plus pressure on the opponent uh, it also uh, the condition can be achieved very easily boost by a great zero is very easy to achieve in Neo Nectar negative don't really do anything else um, so it's pretty vanilla after that I mean you can use it every turn but still it doesn't really do anything else and it's also a 9k base but that's not much of a um, bad thing. I would say this card would be good in budget. Uh, in normally, not really. I don't think it's gonna be run. But maybe just maybe a tech option. Maybe in the future we run like one or two, just in case. I'm not sure. Let's get to our last card now. So our last card, we finally have a potato head um, neo the unit. I'm still waiting for that. Hey yo, pineapple. Uh, his name is Surgeon Marnus. He's a grade one with five five K power and ten K shield. With a skill as auto on rear guard when placed from hand uh, onto a rear guard circle with other unit with ten K of power or more, you can draw a card and during this turn this unit get ten thousand power. So what's the good thing about this unit? Oh, okay, it's a free plus. It's an easy condition to achieve because you get to draw a card. Um, negative is that it only work on place from hand and it's a 5k base. But that is pretty good. Um, it might be run as like a one off or a two off, maybe. I don't think it's gonna be. Uh, in budget, it's probably gonna be run. It's very easy to achieve. I know they're trying to do like the 10k token, but the 10k power is just very easy. You just call a Sylvia, call a plant, call this, you draw, and then gain 10k. Like, this card is very good. But it's not good to the point that it might be run ever maybe like a two off maybe. Our extra plus in draw is actually pretty good. It's kinda like tree, but light light tree. With no count with uh, like it it's a tree but you don't get like plus five K 
but less plus 5k, but you need to play a CB. Uh, it's kind of like a tree, but yeah. I think this card is good. So that's going to wrap up our um, weekly countdown. Next week, I'm guessing by the, by next week, we're going to get the VR. So excited for Severos and the Grade 1 Everos. Let's see what it do. I hope we get more Everos card than just Oliver. Uh, than just the main Dragon line and Oliver. Although uh, there's like an extra grade one uh, Abros or something. I hope so. I think this stream they're going to review um, Sephiroth. I think. I'm not sure. It might just be a battle video. I really am not sure. I think it's Sephiroth still. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, video. Um, of course, if you like the video, subscribe. And yeah. Uh, I know you guys have been enjoying the soundtrack, but I have a very news to say that I ran out of soundtrack to post until Bushu make more and put it on the stream. I hope it's not another Shin Shin theme on tomorrow. You know, sorry I'm a bit late too, but yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and keep playing.